Okay, folks, welcome back to Let's Play Wizards and Warriors by D.W. Bradley. Last time we left off, we were down here in the crypt, uh, investigating further, looking for the Maven Sword. Uh, so we can fight the evil that's uh, throwing its shadow across the land once again. Um, so we are pretty full up with treasure um, but Musashi is way overloaded uh, a couple things I did learn since the last game this red line was nowhere in the manual I, I, I went over that thing back and forth but from experimentation I found that if your item is damaged more than 10% it shows red so it just lets you know you have a damaged item there um I also found out that if you are encumbered, you do in fact have minuses to hit and so forth. So, <clears throat> we're going to uh, see what we can do to uh, give Musashi some, take some load off his shoulders here. How's he doing? All right, let's take that and give that to her. Okay, he's still in the white, so no problem. Masashi, give him some more shields. Can't carry anymore, okay. All right, and so you can take an X. Okay, so he's pretty much full up. He's in the yellow, though. So let's give that to Chuck. Okay. Uh, Masashi's still in the red. So let's give some of this stuff to Jock. Jock Iron Helm. Okay, now he's in the white. Jock's in the white. Okay, excellent. She's in the red. Uh, although that's not that much of a problem for a wizard, but I guess we'll throw that down there. That down there. Now she's in the white, and she's in the white. So, we have plenty of space in here, but it's gonna make her uh, encumbered. Got plenty of space in here, it's gonna make him encumbered. So, I think we'll just do a little bit more adventuring and then we'll head to town. So, let's see, I know I'm pretty sure I dropped something on the ground just then. So, let's see if John can pick it up. Alright, so let's see what we got here. Alright. We got a bag. And a bag. And a club. Alright. So I think we're just gonna travel just a little bit further and then we're gonna head back to town. So another couple of rooms. And we'll head back. Smashing the crates, nothing. Could be a critter in here, so we'll back off. And it looks okay. Leggings, uh, bag, can't carry anymore. Yeah, we're uh, loaded up. Okay. All right. This game is a little choppy. Not too bad. I'm actually downloading a game from a web. Uh, Gamers Gate is a pretty good store, and they're having a seven dollar. It's a sale for Dead Space for seven bucks. I haven't played that yet. It seems like a damn good deal. All right, tricks. She thinks it's moderate. We should get through this. She's whipping through them pretty fast. Got it. Okay. Bag of treasure. Bag of treasure. Dagger. Dagger. And that's it. Okay, smash this stuff, and that, okay, alright, let's just take a peek, okay, I think we're gonna head back to town, okay, <coughs> um, so on the mandolin front, um, my fingers on my left hand are screaming with pain, Um, <laughs> I've been practicing quite a bit. Um, 
Uh, I'm doing a song called Out in the Meadow. And I think... I think I'm going the right way. Uh, I want to get the hell out of here, right? I'm going this way. And I want to go... Yeah. So I'm going the right way, no problems. Uh, what was I saying? Um, Out in the Meadow, it's a medieval song. Um, and um, it's in a time signature that I'm not that used to. Uh, right now it's a six eight, and um, hmm, actually I think I want to go like this, um, and it's a little uh, more complicated than the last song I did. So, um, I, uh, so um, it's gonna take me a little bit to get it down perfectly. So, uh, probably, I don't know, not, if not the next, here we are, next, not, not the next, let's, let's play, bastards, the one after that, maybe, uh, it's, uh, been a challenge, I've probably put a couple hours of practicing into it to get it down, but it's just not internet ready yet, <laughs> even for just a, a let's play, um, um, but I think it should be good, and it's been great practice. It's really getting me back to where I was. Um, so that should be good. Um, I got a whole book full of mandolin songs, so... Uh, usually these LPs are, could take like... Uh, like a like hundred or more. Um, so I should have plenty of songs... Uh, plenty of LPs to put plenty of songs in. Okay. Gotta head back to town. Oh, it's a little choppy because of that download. I am quite a fan of horror games. One of my favorite all-time games in the world is System Shock 2. Um, I did enjoy Bioshock as well, but I, um, I don't know, I just, I liked, I liked it a lot, I really did, uh, but it just wasn't as good as System Shock 2, um, but it was, it was damn good, <laughs> so, and I heard Dead Space, uh, a lot less RPG elements than the Bioshock had, but, um, it did have, it does have some sort of like upgrades and so forth to, to make you feel like you're progressing. Ah, here we are. Okay, let's go into the armory. Hey, I'm Smitty. Glad to meet ya. What can I do for ya? Alright, so let's go to him. We'll pull the gold. So we have enough to join a guild right now, which is good. Well, let's see what we got here. Um. Let's see, let's cast Identify the Shields first, I guess. Um, one of the kind of annoying things is, is that, um, here we go. Like, these rotted shields I've already identified, so you think that I kind of know what they were, but anyway, so now let's sell the things. That's, that's my wooden shield, actually. I have a bow in there now, where the shield usually goes, but let's go to this rotted shield. Uh, rotted shield, rotted shield. Rotted shield, rotted shield. Okay, and let's see. <clears throat> now let's send up a bunch of swords. Try to group them into like things here. Can't fit anymore, I guess. Alright. Let's see. And, uh, let's see. Done. Identify. Um, sword. Rusted small sword. A short sword. 
Frosted Lawn Sword. Okay. Let's sell this crap. Small sword, short sword, rusted long sword, rusted long sword, rusted long sword. Got a bunch of these rusted long swords. Okay. Done. Jock. Uh, right. I guess we'll send the axes down to Jock and have him identify the axes. Jock, pool gold, identify, axe, check it all Yep. And the shield, we know it's crap, so we're just gonna sell it. Um, okay, so, get rid of that. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, that, and that. And we know for three gold, it's a rotted shield. Okay, done. Um, identify these great pairs. Um, excellent, we're going to sell one of those. Alright. And we're going to give that rapier to Trix, which she's going to use. I think the rapier does 3 to 5 with a plus 1 hit. And the short sword does 2 to 5 with no plus 1. So, we're going to sell that and give her that. Alright. Guess we'll throw the daggers down to her. So, she'll get those daggers. Let's see. We pay, see, 11%. And that's why it's red. Okay. Hopefully this part isn't too boring. I only got a couple minutes left. Um, identify tricks, pool of gold, uh, dagger, twenty-five. Wow. All right. Cursed dagger. They're all freaking cursed. Unbelievable. All right. I'm glad I didn't equip anyone. So sell these bastards. Are they worth anything? Yeah, they are. That and get rid of that and that and okay, we get rid of that. Okay, and uh, if we know that this, this knife is only six gold to identify, that it's not worth much, so we'll get rid of it. Uh, same thing with that one. We'll lay it on the bracelet for the moment. Okay, we got a thousand. Two people can join the guild. All right. Uh, let's see. Sword. Let's, uh, so, get five. We know it's five to identify. I mean, to sell, so it's worthless. Okay. All right. Uh, we got a few more things left to identify here, but I think we're gonna do that on the next Let's Play. We'll see you then. Thanks for hanging out.